What is up guys, Kenny D here, and today we're doing this year's Christmas haul video for you guys. Today I'm going to show you right here in front of me. The first one is right here, is the Studio Series 78 Sideswipe. I mean, there he is in his Corvette Stingray alternate mode. Some of the fans, some of the fans that think they, Trax is going to be appearing in the live action films, but turns out it wasn't tracks it is actually sideswipe so they thought tracks is going to make an appearance in a live action film since he also turned into a corvette stingray let's see i mean you can tell the design of this corvette stingray is looking fantastic i mean let me get my head let me get my ring light so you can see it give us a second guys Okay, I'm back. Apparently, there it is. You can see they got the headlights in. Look at that. Oh, hang on. There you go. There it is. Looking sweet. Yeah, I thought it was better than the uh, other one, studio series that we got so far. But, we have Sideswipe. So, I prefer keeping him in vehicle mode whenever I get the Kingdom one, like that one. I would, uh, put him next to him. But for now, I'll be putting him in vehicle mode whenever I get a chance to do. So, that's my whole, that's my decision. Looks like the wheels are not even stayed on right. Man must have, uh, put the transformation incorrectly. Yeah, you, you can tell that's Sideswipe, so, there you go. Now that's Sideswipe, the Studio Series version. Now we got the War for Cybertron Trilogy Kingdom Wheeljack. I know he's going to be appearing in the Rise of the Beast movie, but now he's ready to be in the Kingdom line. Let's go. Alright, this is Wheeljack in his looky, good-looking uh, Lancia Stratos mode. Uh, if, I might, if you might say. So I'm I'm in, I'm impressed about this guy. So I'm guessing he does come with weapons, which is his uh, blaster and his blaster cannon, which is supposed to be go on top of it like this, I think. Yeah, I like this wheeljack. I know he transformed into a Latia Latia Stratos. Uh, don't get me wrong there, cause that's the point. We get it. Blah blah blah. You get the point, because he transformed to a Latin C. Stratos. And this is the card that came with. This is a different one this time. It shows Black Arachnia from uh, Beast Wars from 1996. Almost like we're getting more Transformers toys up in this beast. I mean, that's that's awesome. I know it's a short, review, short look at the Wheeljack toy that we got from Christmas, so let's just move it out of the side. And now we're going to the best part. We got two versions of the Legacy toys that we got so far. And that is the Core Class Hot Rod and the Deluxe Class DK2 Guard. Alright, let's check out Hot Rod first. And let's take a look. Uh, here is the core class hot rod. I mean, he's a he's like a small looking vehicle. I mean, he looks so tiny. Well, he is a core class after all. Well, he's both he well, Bolt, Wheeljack, and the Revenge of the Fallen Sideswipe were both deluxe class. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is starting to cracking up a little bit. Anyway. Just like these two, they were, this one's the smallest hot rod that I can get. So this is what I deserve. <laughs> so, there, there he is. Looking nice. I mean, he looks accurate to the cartoon and the movie. <sighs> Not to be confused, the live action movie. Live action movie version of Hot Rod. The sooner the Hot Rod live action movie, the better. So, that's Hot Rod. Now we got DK2 Guard. I never get this one before for, like, forever. So, anyway, let's get to it. All right, here is DK12. Or DK2 Guard. 
I'm, 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 okay, so apparently he's a repaint of Ironhide. No joke there. I mean, you could tell from the headlights and the body, the design, that's actually the repaint of Ironhide. I mean, I like that. Kind of like it. The, uh, it's, it fits. It fits so well with it. Even, I like this one, because, I mean, he's based off the Diaclone toy. You know, um, they should give, like, a different name this time. Like, um, uh, I, 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 I don't know what words. Tell me, um, type in the comments down below, what would you give this name, what would you give this Transformer a name? You know, a repaint of Ironhide. What would you give this guy a name? Because DK2 Guard is pretty, is a really dumb name, so. I want your answers in the comments. What would you give this name of repaint of Ironhide? What would you give this name? Let me know. Nothing too inappropriate, nothing else, just name. Nothing, nothing else. Just name this Ironhide looking figure, and I want to know. So... I know it sounds dumb, but the name the name of DK2 Guard is just no, no, no. I'm not not a big fan because I really not a big fan of the name at all. Cause I kind of don't like it. And right, we got two more presents left to go that I'm going to show you. So that this is that's DK2 Guard, which is one of the worst toys I ever got is these two monster trucks here. The one on the left is the Earth and Surf Horsepower and Aqua Stallion, which is pretty pretty strange. And we got Podium Crasher. I don't have this one before since like a long time ago. So be on the lookout for that. So let's go. Alright, to clarify you, I don't have these guys. Well, ones except for Podium Crasher. I don't have this guy. Since, um, after I got Race Ace, Hot Wheels Racing number one, and blah blah blah, you know it. It's right here. This is Podium Crasher. I, I don't have this one. I'm, since we got Town Hauler in that one. Let me, hang on, let me find Town Hauler. Oh, here we go. See, I have Town Hauler before. I've covered Town Hauler on the channel, if you, want to have, if you haven't checked that out yet. I did it before, not like once or twice. I mean, I'm serious. I mean, I did did cover that on the channel. All right, so that's them. Hang on, there we go. That's Podium Crasher. Now we got Aqua Stallion and Horsepower. So they have the same body designs, which which a few differences. They're like this one's a new truck. So honestly, I think I like this one better. So this is Aqua Stallion. They should name it like Seahorse Sprayer or something or Seek. Uh, Sea Stallion, rather than Aqua Stallion. There's horsepower, looking pretty cool. I mean, yeah, I know, they, they, they look amazing in their own rights. So, I'm pretty sure these are these are the best ones so far, and I have ever dig it. Alright. There's only one more, I think. There's one more, I'm pretty sure. That's my case. It. That's my case. And that, of course, could have been... Pop Goes and Blake the Badger from Pop, from Pop Goes. You know, the game that that always talks about, you know, Pop Goes, the uh, Final Fantasy inspired game. Yeah, that one. So, I mean, I like these. So, I'm guessing we got them all. I know I got Candy the Cat before, and now I got Blake the Badger and Pop Goes. The Weasel. So... There you go. How cool is that? I mean, yeah. So anyway, that is my Christmas haul of this year. I know 2022 has been like a crazy year for us. So that's my thoughts. Well, this was a great Christmas haul review for you guys. My favorites has to be Pop Goes and Blake the Badger. They're one of my favorite ones, but... One of my least favorite ones was the DK2 Guard, which was a repaint of Ironhide, which is pretty strange. Pretty weird at the same time. So, 
So I want to thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Hopefully this new year will be so interesting. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.